Hey, fellas, happy new year. Thank you for taking my call. Yeah, what's up, man? Uh, so, uh, question. I hear a lot of people uh, chiming in, and, and you guys have talked about it as well, about mm-hmm. trading back in the draft to try to, you know, obtain either, you know, the tackle, the offensive line everyone's talking about, or just more picks in general. Right. And I'm looking at this top ten, and I wonder, you know, not, not a lot of these teams that are at least in the top ten are known for really moving up in the draft. You know, a lot of them are actually pretty close to the chest as far as what they do draft-wise. So I was wondering what you guys think. Cause I figure you don't want to move any farther than, than 10th. You know, you don't want to get, go that far back. But what teams in the top 10 do you think would be willing to trade with the Redskins to get up to get Chase Young? And then in addition, as far as general managers, I think uh, Ed Dobbs, the assistant GM for the Colts, who was also in Seattle during the Legion of Boom days. Uh-huh. What do you guys think of potentially like luring him away from – Indianapolis to kind of fix, you know, especially what the Redskins have uh, with the uh, well, secondary. You Appreciate know, it, fellas. You, you know more about Ed Dobbs than me because I didn't even know the name. So. I know Lou Dobbs. So if, <laughs> if Ed Dobbs is a, is a popular candidate, yeah, I can see them at least looking at him. Um, as far as your other question, what teams would move up, I guess the only – See, I think the Dolphins and the Chargers are two teams to watch because they desperately need quarterbacks. Um and did Herbert improve his stock yesterday? He didn't throw the ball that well, but he had three rushing three touchdowns. Rushing. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I watched most of the game. Herbert, to me, is he's good, but I don't think he's a guy that you move up in the draft to I get. I think the That's guy's Tua. If teams it's believe Tua. Tua's good to go <clears throat> and they believe that they got a shot, that's who might move up. And right. the, the two teams you mentioned Correct. need quarterbacks for the future. The Dolphins are going to need a quarterback. And obviously the Chargers are going to need a quarterback because I don't think that Rivers – I mean, Rivers was crying in the press conference after the last game because he knows his reign is over. But um, it, I think it kind of depends on where, what Tua looks like. But you also don't looks, know. If Tua looks really good, I think there will be a couple teams that will trade up to get him. And then this other kid, Jordan Love, out of Utah State, who's a bigger kid, didn't have a great year, had a much better year last year. He might be a kid that teams reach for as well. And you also don't know. You Every team in the league says Burrow won Chase Young too. Mm-hmm. I'm just looking at the draft order. I'm looking at somebody's mock. They've got the Lions in desperate need of an edge rusher. Okay. Terrible defense in Detroit. They might be desperate to move up. Now, I don't know what you get for flipping one spot, mm-hmm. and maybe they roll the dice. So I just think you don't know. And what you want is the Redskins, look, they whacked Bruce Allen. Everybody's celebrating. Got rid of Bruce Allen. But what you want is a decision maker in place, and maybe Rivera is going to steer it. We'll find out later today. The GM who's willing to make calls and listen, right, and not be closed minded and just be like it's Chase Chase Young and that's it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I agree. I don't think they would do work with Look, the Panthers. Would the Cardinals move up? No, Jags. There's a lot of work to do. So. By the way, the Jags. What, if you're the Jags, are I you know. just eating Nick Foles' contract that's and an- just that's another your, thing. your Gardner Minshew? That's another. Th- Team. I liked Minshew. Did you see after the season when he was asked about his rookie stats? And they were like, you know, um, your rookie stats were comparable to Kyler Murray's and Daniel Jones. And he said, better. Right. Who's this guy? Better. Yeah. No, but that's another thing that's question marks. You brought up that's a terrible contract now. It's a terrible contract. Yeah. I mean, is he going to be your backup making $20 million a year or whatever he's making? I mean, I guess you could maybe <laughs> justify it. It sucks if your backup is making more money than the starter, but let's say you have a certain amount allocated to starter and backup, mm-hmm. and you thought it was going to be Foles and Minshew as the backup, and now you flip it. You're still paying the same amount of money. Right. Yeah, I agree. Um, we'll see. It's going to be very interesting the next few months. 